A dorsal incision is made to expose the scaphalunate joint. An ECRB or palmaris longus tendon graft is harvested. The free tendon graft is then whip stitched on both ends. Next, K wires are placed into the lunate and scaphoid to position the bones for drilling. The laser marked K wires, cannulated drill bits, and drill guides are then used to create the interosseous bone tunnels. The final drill tunnel is placed into the distal pole of the scaphoid. The tendon graft and suture tape construct is then loaded onto the DX swivel lock and inserted into the scaphoid. Next, the tendon suture construct is passed through the lunate tunnel, the bones reduced, and the construct secured dorsally with a tenodesis screw. The final DX swivel lock is placed in the distal pole of the scaphoid to control scaphoid flexion and complete the procedure.